Hello guys, welcome back to New Travel. I am dietitian Rashmi Sethi. Hope you guys are doing extremely healthy and well. We all like to travel for work, right? But maintaining healthy habits like healthy eating and exercising can be difficult while traveling for work. So today in this video, I'll be telling you about few tips which will help you to choose healthy foods, keep up with your exercise schedule and also to avoid the common meal mistakes that we do while traveling for work. While these work and business trips can feel like a nice getaway from your day-to-day -day business or work routine, we should be mindful enough and avoid overindulging during these uh, work trips. So now I'm giving you a few examples of perishable and non-perishable food items which you can always carry along with you during these uh, work or business trips, which will not only help you to satisfy your hunger, but also will help you to keep a check on your calorie count. You can always carry perishable food items like fruits, vegetable sticks, hummus, dips, some pre-prepared meals, boiled eggs, which you can always store in the refrigerator or the side cooler or the mini bar, which is there in your hotel room. This will not only help you to make the right choice, but also, as I mentioned, to keep a check on how many calories you are eating whenever you are hungry. And for those who do not want to worry about the perishable food items, can carry uh, non-perishable food items or snacks like energy bars, nuts and seeds, kurmura, makhanas, roasted chana, which they can enjoy in between breaks or to take care of their uh, small hunger pangs while in the hotel room. While traveling for work, we are more focused on getting our work done and meeting the timelines. That is absolutely correct. But what we forget along the way is eating healthy. So here are a few common meal mistakes which all the work travelers do and uh, the ones which we should be avoiding. The common mistake which all the work travelers do is to skip the breakfast. I can totally understand that the work trips are very hectic and we want to finish it off within the time limit given. But starting off right with the breakfast is very very important which will not only help you to keep your metabolism up or boost it but will also keep you away from the food cravings in the later part of the day. And yes, the breakfast need not always be elaborate. If you do not have time because of your hectic schedule, you can also go along or start off with a bowl of cereal, which definitely would give you enough energy to keep running and active throughout the day. Another common mistake which all the work travelers do is to eat oversized portions. Now, when we are traveling for work, we usually eat outside with our colleagues or in the restaurant in our hotels. Uh, for most of us people, entire or full hotel size or restaurant sized uh, portions are too much for the entire day's calorie intake. And hence, we much, must be watchful and mindful about how much food are we putting on our plate. Or we can also tell the restaurant people to serve half the portion size so that you eat as much as you want and also do not waste food. Another common mistake is to drink less water. We usually sit in air conditioned office or we are so busy in our hectic schedules that we forget to drink water. So make cautious efforts, put alarms uh, and drink at least two to three liters of water throughout the day, however uh, busy you may be. And if you want to know of easy ways how you can stay hydrated while at work or in your busy schedule, you can see my YouTube video, the link for which I'm giving below. Do not drink too much of alcohol. If you're going out for business parties or uh, outings along with your colleagues, you can definitely enjoy a drink. But do not drink in excess. Remember, your mind needs to be clear for the business meetings and work the next day. So do not overdo just because you're traveling. Do not give in to peer pressure. While going out for business parties or after work parties, eat and drink as much as you want and as much as your body allows you to and not as much as your friends or colleagues want you to. Remember, you are in charge of your own health. Healthy eating while on business trips can be challenging, but it is definitely not impossible. So here are a few tips which will help all the busy business travelers or work travelers to be on track and also will help to keep or maintain a balance between healthy lifestyle or healthy eating and their busy work schedules. Always read nutrition labels of whatever foods you are buying or purchasing from the market. This will help you to know what you are putting inside the body. Also, while ordering any food from the restaurant, you can always ask them what goes in that dish so that you are aware what you are eating. 
If the food that you're ordering from the restaurant has a sauce or dip that goes along with it, always tell the restaurant people to give it separately so that you eat as much as you want it. Make sure that all your meals are rich in proteins. Proteins will give you satiety and help you to be full for a longer period of time and thus help you to stay full during long meeting hours. Always make sure that you get a one liter of bottle along with you, which will keep on giving you reminders and keep you away from any kind of excuses of not drinking water. Be careful with the coffee. While a cup of coffee can definitely inject you with a lot of energy to cope up with the stressful and long working hours, but too much of it is definitely not good. Snacks matter. I have already given you a list of perishable and non-perishable food items which you can enjoy in your hotel room or while at work, which will take care of your small hunger pangs without making you feel guilty. Avoid empty calories. Avoid drinking uh, fruit juices, soft drinks, flavored milk whenever you're thirsty. Rather, you can opt for green tea, buttermilk, lime juice, etc. which will not only quench your thirst but will also give you good nutrition. Plan your meals. This will not only keep you away from overeating but also will help to make sure that you're eating the right kind of food at the right time and with a good amount of nutrients. Just like eating healthy can be a challenge for all the business and work travelers, so can be sticking to their workout and uh, exercise schedules. So here are a few tips which can help all the business and work travelers to squeeze in some form of physical activity in their hectic schedules. Make sure that you wake up early or at least plan ahead of time so that you can squeeze in some form of uh, exercise. Take advantage of the gym uh, in your hotel or at your workplace. Make sure that you count your steps every day. Do not forget to pack in your gym wear so that you can wear it uh, while exercising. Also, uh, try and do some body weight training exercises in the hotel room. Also, you can look in for some park uh, uh, nearby to your hotel so that you can just go there after your work schedules while you reach the uh, hotel room. And also, do not overdo. Remember, you are here to work. So after your tired and hectic schedule, your body may not allow you uh, enough energy to work out. So please listen to your body and, uh, you know, only work out as much as you can. Hope this video was useful for all the people who travel frequently for work and their business. If you did like the video, do not forget to hit the like button. And if you have any more questions related to what I spoke today or any other topic related to wellness and nutrition, you can always comment in the section below. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please go and do it fast. And yes, you can share this video with all who uh, need it, right? Uh, till we meet again, take care, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.